So what is going on YouTube, my name is Mehul and welcome to another video in which we'll be discussing another tag very commonly used known as the paragraph tag. Now the paragraph tag is um, a tag which would be used to actually, um, you know, to put it in a very simple language for now, to group a bunch of text you can say on the screen and if I generalize it in even more sense, group a bunch of elements on the screen right so this is a single element that's how we say it in the html in the web development world so this is an element h1 element right it is an h1 tag sure enough on screen it is an h1 element this is some sort of text element right which you don't really know about so there's another tag called paragraph tag which is just simply a single p right so if you enclose something in a p that's a paragraph now you might ask me that how is it different if i just write this thing right Clearly, you cannot see any difference at all. Now, the difference is, for now, unless you start uh, working with CSS, which is something you're going to start working later on, the difference is that, uh, for example, if I have, you know, this line of text, and I have this line of text as well. Now, you see that I wrote these two in, a, in two different lines, right? but technically they should appear on the on two different lines as well in the output as well right but the thing is html does not really work that way it squashes them together and shows you like this just like it you know you can see on the screen so what you can do is you can enclose them in their own paragraph tags right so this makes it paragraph one and if you do the same for this it's going to make it paragraph two you can now see they are in their separate lines just like you know some long paragraphs would be so if i copy paste this oops if i copy paste this multiple times you're gonna see what i'm talking about so this is one paragraph and this is some other paragraph right so this is how it works so yeah now you have headings and you have paragraphs so that's all for this video i hope you liked it I hope you learned something from it. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you then very quickly in the next video.